wonderful. You know, including things which I still haven't done. I've got to do this. <laughs> you know, like send a lunch platter to the hospice. All these oh. beautiful instructions. It was one. I got lucky that he did yeah, this. Yeah, you should send a lunch platter to the hospice. I'm going They'd love to. that. I'm going to. I, I'm going to do it, Dad. Wherever you may be in the past, present, or future, it's happening. I'm sorry. A little distracting. That's not a good excuse. Easy to send a lunch platter. Well, Dad. It has been really great getting to know you. Likewise, thank you for letting me gab about my work. <laughs> hey, um, I need the hose. Excuse me, pardon me. Can, can you get? I, that's my hose. I need it. Hey, I need it. Hey, 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 who dares to wake an old elevator at first? Anyone up for a game of basketball? No. Baseball? No. Ping pong. No. <laughs> <laughs> fighting it. You're gonna be okay. Face the void. Besides, you're not gonna die yet. That'll be on a rolling chair. Holy chair. Metaphor? Want to slide? <laughs> this is the best slide I've ever been on, honestly. I've been on a lot of water slides. I need you as a bag. Mode. Activate. Let's go back home. So, what are you gonna do now? Meditate or something? Oh, jeez. No, that's embarrassing. No, I'm not enlightened anymore. I wasn't enlightened. It doesn't even mean anything. Hey, Charlotte. Even though your life is out of tune, you can still sing along with it. And it's better to be you and out of tune than acting like someone else who has found enlightenment. What does death look like to you? One clown leg, one clown leg, one clown leg, 14 feet tall. So how was that episode? Perfect. <laughs>